All right, here we go with this championship fight. Will we crown a new UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion tonight? Let's find out. Nice leg kick land. Oh, combination lands for her there. It's hard to recall a past fight of hers in which her striking has looked this fluid and pitiful. She's sharp as a tack. Sharp as a tack. Everything is landing. She's doing a great job. Pinpoint jab placement there, and a nice job to take advantage of her edge and reach. Just misses there with the left. Again, back into this position. Ty clinch for her here. We'll see what she can do with it. Takedown defense holds up. Left hand. Back and forth we go. All right, both women now continuing to try to get a more dominant position here in the clinch. I can hear Dominic Cruz just scream. That is how you scramble, folks. Beautiful punch. Nice body kick. Catches the kick there. We'll see what she can do with it. Under three minutes now to go in the round. And they set it. All right, so Amanda Nunes getting off here again as usual. Really as well-rounded a fighter as we have in the men's or the women's game here. Yeah, regardless of gender, right? Regardless of gender, Amanda Nunes stands amongst the best in pound for pound in the entire UFC. It's a beautiful fast foot jab with meaning. Oh, here's a kick to the body, blocked though by Nunes. Nice punch there by Nama Yunus. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Rose Nama Yunus. Big punch to the clinch. Both fighters here continuing to try to get a more dominant position in the clinch, getting fatigued in the process, I would think. It's very taxing to be chest to chest, a position we call 50-50 because nobody has the advantage. Who's gonna be the one to find that one little area that they can expose to give them the slightest advantage? Back and forth we go. Not there. Nice punch by Nunes. Clinch. And now she's got the tie clinch. Final seconds here of round one. All right, so again, the fighters clinch here. Kind of had an inkling we'd find ourselves back in this situation. Absolutely. Both of these fighters love fighting chest to chest. The uglier the fight, the better. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, here we go. Round two is underway. Round one, pretty competitive. I mean, you weren't looking at your phone, so you seemed that entertaining. Yeah, very, very entertaining. But when you're not looking down at the phone, there's something to be watched. These are two of the best female fighters in the UFC. Effective strike there by Nama Yunus. in this matchup tonight. Oh, nice right hand by Rose. Stuffs the takedown shot there. How good is her takedown D? Big kick land. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Massive head kick. Well, she's had a lot of moments in the fight. You know, her one is very good, but you're not even getting one, two. What about the one, two? What about the one, two, three? How about an uppercut following the three strikes? Allow them to string together. Be confident in knowing that you have practiced this. You are ready to land in combination. Let it flow. Nice punch land over the top. 46 total strikes have landed for the Lioness Amanda Nunes. And in terms of the accuracy, landing at a 50% clip tonight against Rose Namajunas. Wild attempt with the right hand there. Oh, that's an 
outstanding attempt with the kick there. Now we'll see if she can follow it up. So fast to the target. What a great job. Oh, man, I hate to laugh, but she lands another kick there, and now you're really starting to see that visible damage on the other side. When you start seeing the redness in the leg, that means that every time she is driving that baseball bat right into the thigh where she wants it to land, and now her opponent is limping. Her opponent's wounded, her opponent's injured, and now watch the target be way more stationary. 90 seconds to go. Oh, beautiful hip toss there to take her down. She's flying Cormier Airlines tonight. She's flying first class. She got thrown right on her head. You have gotta keep those hips back if you're gonna defend this position. Again, back into this position. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace here in this second round. It took her a while to find her range. She's in a strong striking rhythm now. Nice, nice right here. Beautiful kick. 20 seconds left. Now with the kick, that one is blocked, though, by Nunes. All right, so what a round it was, DC. Take us through some of the highlights. Got to think her kicking game is going to be featured prominently here. She did decent work with the hands, but the kicking game was the thing that truly separated her from her opponent. She was landing kick after kick and truly slowing down her opponent in that round. All right, so the previous two rounds, pretty entertaining, DC. We'll see who has the upper hand here as this next round gets on. Very evenly matched fight, and we knew exactly this when they were matched up. We were excited about the fight. We kind of... Oh! Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Game of inches right there, Damn, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. So she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. As efficient as any striker in the division, this is a world-class display of striking here tonight. 69 total strikes have already landed for Amanda Nunes. And striking with about 48% accuracy against Rose Namajunas. Well, they don't let you wear headgear, but she don't need it. Davis is her Fantastic fight by both of these women. High level striking, great cardio, great fight. And they separate. Oh, really using the reach advantage there with that punch, DC. We have now crossed the midpoint of this fight. Hands While well, Nama Yunus's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. And they separate. Ooh, what a punch. Just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. Absolutely flush on the land, and I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming, so sometimes it's the strike you don't see coming that spells your fate. And ultimately, it goes in the books as a big knockout win for her here tonight. So there she is, folks, a woman who now needs no introduction, the UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion of the World, getting it done by knockout and with major style points here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eden Levine's called to stop for this contest at three minutes, three seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC bantamweight champion of the world.
know how excited this makes me. We got a new UFC. And tonight she joins a list of some of the best women's fighters we've ever seen.